You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. <laughs> well, that's what you call yourself, I'm told. But what have you actually done for the people of Sector 5, hmm? There's this little thing called karma. How a person treats others dictates how they themselves should be treated. And believe me, I'll get you the dress that you earned. All right, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? All right then, let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> so I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. Hey, no one asked you to do that. But there's so much you don't know. This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Eric, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch. Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. said you'd be swinging by. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys' night out in Wall Market? Uh. Kid, if I know the madam, and I do, this was all her idea. I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword, but when it comes to damn near anything else, well, I can't help but have my doubts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizons, neither. Seeking new experiences. Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect you while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. What do you say? You game? Huh. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> That's the spirit. You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Merck. So weird. There it is. Yes. Can have just one. Never seen you before. Wow, I've been waiting for you to show up. Thanks for coming. And welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Wanna try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him! He's a scrawny little thing. I can snap him like a twig. Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. What do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. So, you up for a round? Ha! You're taking me on? You look like a dried up old turpsic hole left out the sun. Got no idea what you're getting into, little man. All right, enough talk. We'll settle this the tried and true traditional way. A squat off. Now, let's all see what you've got. No way I'm letting you win. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's 
how it's done. You've got this. Yeah. Come on. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. Yeah. <laughs> the best you can do. <laughs> Your form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. You've got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. You've got this. Come on. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. <sighs> Nothing to it. How the hell did I lose to this scrawny little kid who looks like he doesn't even consume his daily recommended amount of protein? Ronnie, you know it's all about quality, not mass. You're too quick to judge people by their build. That and your overtrained ego are the main reasons you lost to our bold challenger here. Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson. And sorry for dragging you into it. Cloud? We're all one big family here at this gym, and now you're part of it. If you're ever up for training, our doors are always open to you. Let's work together to maintain healthy minds and bodies. Yeah! If you're ever in the mood for another workout, just talk to Jay or Ronnie. Welcome. Anything in particular you're looking for? Oh, you must be the Merc I've been hearing about. I need you to help me out with my dad. His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. Could you bring him back here? He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkard's. <laughs> Just over there. Wait up, Cloud! Sam caught me up on everything. He said you're gonna go rescue Tifa. And to do that, you're trying to learn all about Walmart. Bro, I know this town like the back of my hand, so I can answer all of your questions. Now, let's go knock this one out. The bar is this way, Cloud. Drunkards, here we come. Uh, are we even allowed to walk through the door? I'm getting a regular zone in kind of five. Can't have just one. It's mostly the same folks every night, so... Oh, yeah, just most in there uninvited. Let's take their rules for this... Hey, old dude! Huh? Son, is that you? Did you always look so... moronic? Well, right back at you. No, whatever. We're here to take you back to the store. I'm not going back! Not ever! My life is ruined! It's over! Kill me now! Come on, there's no need to talk like that, old dude. I'll help you out with whatever you need. Really? Oh, thank you, son! See, I made this bet with the Materia Merchant. A sure thing! But then I lost! And so I had no choice but to steal my heart and surrender my precious inspiration! Your precious inspir- who with the what now? Inspiration! <laughs> Without it, there's simply no point in me ever going back to the store. Got it. I mean, I don't got it, but I just need to get your inspiration back, right? Whatever the hell that is. Leave it to me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you gonna go with your friend? <sighs> Drinks are on me. Oh, oh, oh. It's big to me. Bean popcorn here. Shaped like everybody's face. I've never been inside now that I think about it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't Beautiful night. Why don't we get talking?
thinking about is this. I'm just curious to find out what you It's stronger than you. I just came to bring you your lunch because somebody forgot it. You might be able to feel guilty. Oh, this place is full up. I don't even really know how people use mat- Hey, wait for me! Huh. So this is it, huh? And what do you two want? Uh, uh, I'm here for the precious inspiration you took from the old dude. Inspiration? Oh, that thing. But I didn't take it. I want it fair and square. It's mine by rights now. Well, that's true. But I tell you what, I'll consider giving it back in exchange for a favor. Uh, what you need? Something only real men can deliver. Uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the inn. You know what, you know. No, I don't think I... Wait, the sauce. The sauce? Stop saying the sauce. Anyway, good luck. The time has come for me to wield my powers of assessment. Talk about I can feel it. Yeah. Oh, oh, I can feel it. I'm in for one wild ride. I'm gonna see some weird shit tonight. Yeah. I have the perfect room for the boat with you. Just say the word and I'll show you to it. Huh? I don't know. If you don't need a room, then what the hell do you want? You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Merck. leaving me out here? You need me! You need my knowledge and expertise to unlock the machine's secrets. That's it? That's the one? It looks like a regular old vending machine, right? But wait! <laughs> you ready for this? Alright. This particular model has secret buttons. Where? Well, I can't tell you. It's a secret. You just need to tap into your knowledge and expertise, like grab it and whip it out. And then you'll be able to see everything. I don't need to whip it out. I've done this before. Watch this. Whoa, look at you, bro. Huh? Is this the sauce? I don't know. You're the winner! Have a prize! Shit, that scared me. Well, we've done what we said we would. Let's go back and talk to the guy. Like to be a champ. So where is she? Let's go to the world. Relax, man. Relax. Come on, bro. Hurry up. <laughs> Let's show him what we brought back from our little trip. Oh, it's you two. It's time, bro. The sauce. Huh? What's this thing? Shit. That's not the sauce. Boys, it seems I misjudged you. Sorry for making you go to all this trouble for nothing. Don't worry, there's still time for you to learn and grow as men. Oh, uh, well... If there's anything else we can do, let us know. Oh, right. Hate to break it to you, but that thing you were looking for? Not here. It's long, long gone. You shitting me?! Nope. Sorry. As I recall, the guy who runs the restaurant should have it. Ugh. Well, I guess we know where we're headed next. 
Come on, bro. Well, that's that. Time to polish the old orbs. Give them a spit shine so they positively sparkle. Hey, if you're done here, then get going already. Restaurant up next, huh? Uh, getting kind of hungry, actually. Hold on. I think it's coming from over there. Nope. Uh -huh. Stay focused. We have to build them first. This is what they say. Let's see what's on the menu. Welcome! Feel free to take any open seats. Sorry, we're not here to eat. The Materia guy gave you something, yeah? We want it. Materia guy? Oh, you hear about that? I'm surprised. Didn't take you for the type. Let me ask you something. Either of you know anything about cooking? Nope, never cooked once. That's too bad. For some reason, my food doesn't taste nearly as good as it used to. I was hoping one of you two might be able to help me figure it out. I've narrowed it down to the fridge, the stove, or the power supply. But I'm not sure what's to blame. Man, I seriously have no idea what it could be. This sucks. You know, your fridge might be broken. Maybe it's not keeping the ingredients cold enough. That's so. You're an expert on all things ice? Okay then. Let's see if we can fix this by fiddling with the temperature. Well, shit. Think I've got to get a new one. This one's clearly on his last legs. Here, eat up. Man, this looks great. My stomach. I, uh, uh, I just remembered something I need to take care of. <laughs> uh, still no good? Back to square one. Oh, and here's a voucher with my apologies. Get the poor guy some medicine, will you? Drugs. I need all the drugs right now. Out of the way. Them to the time and the fire will change. I'm telling you, what if I the world? All five doorstep, you bum! You're scaring away my customers! Sitting here, watching them. Sanctuary! Hey, you! This yours? Well... Oh, that about you you got there? Should've said something sooner. Come on in. What is it with today? People are dropping like flies. Besides this dumbass? Ah, loads of... I got enough outstanding orders to fill a book. I was about to leave and make some delivery. Uh, oh, I can't very well leave him alone now, can I? Hey, you're not doing much. Maybe you can deliver that medicine for me. You're what? Military or something, right? Then you must know a thing or two about dealing with the sick and injured. You're a lifesaver, literally. So, let me see, what needs delivery? Here, need you to deliver this to someone. You'll probably find this guy sprawled out on the ground somewhere, but make sure you check his symptoms before giving him meds. Pretty rowdy place, isn't it? That's what folks from all over come here for. Get rowdy, let loose. So weird. Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? 
I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's... Tifa's gonna be... I just... I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro, I can call you bro, right? Nope. Just wanna say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. Ah. So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said... I think this is the way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. You know, I really wish I could be just like you. My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze everything. So, bro, do you have any advice for a smart, stand-up guy like myself? Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but uh, I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Go find Aerith at Madame M's. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. Think you can handle that? Yes, sir! You again? Got that letter of approval you mentioned. Hmm? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah. It's for Aerith. Who? Oh, that girl you were with. Sorry to hear that. Well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I can't let you in. I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. If you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. Go on, get out of here. if you get picked or not anyway. Yeah, but still... You put a lot of work into this. Did you put a lot of work into this? Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition? No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. See what, exactly? According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone, and they'd like to meet in person. Huh? up and fabulous. Where are you headed? Well, what do we have here? You're quite the pretty little lady. Uh. Hey, I see the way you're looking at her. I was looking to confirm what I already knew. There is no one hotter. Hey there, cutie. Where are you headed? Why don't you let me buy you a cup of coffee? I give her a few dollars. So 
that dress was completely overshadowed. Why are we here? To see the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. What? It's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. At least, that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you wanna save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. So, here's how I think we should approach him. Madame M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? So, you a top sider? Good evening. Welcome to the entertainment extravaganza that is the Honeybee Inn. We're here to see Andrea Rodea. You must be Mr. Cloud. He's waiting for you. Mr. Cloud? I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please, make your way to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back, sir. Straight through those doors and down the hall. Andrea shows transcend beauty and entertainment. I've tripped at this moment. The honeybee is... And here's the man of the hour. Chosen by Andrea himself. Our honored guest. This is your first time, right? It's okay. Do you want to practice your dance moves first? Why would I want to do that? Andrea thought it might be a good idea. Over here! Come on now! Hey, hold on! I guess. Come on, come on! Oh, the show's about to start! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> my, my. Is that Cloud? Mm. Mm. Darling, I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you just sit tight until Andrea takes the stage. Look at his muscles. Aw, he's flushing. Life can be hard, it can be bitter, but we can make it all so sweet. Here at the honeybee in every moment.
Welcome to the Hanbi Inn, Cloud. You seek my approval, do you? I understand. But those who crave my favor must first prove that they know how to move. Think you can follow my lead? Yes, I will transform you into a vision of beauty. Now, without further ado, let us begin!
True beauty is an expression of the heart. A thing without shame, to which notions of gender don't apply. Don't ever be afraid of it. show today blew my mind! Hey, look at me! I could dance too! How much did you drink Just tonight? Come over I here. can't help How it, about it was amazing! Drink? You talk! Was it planned from the start? Probably not. Did you see their look of surprise? 